Hi boys and girls, good morning. This video is going to show you how to find Schoology and how to use the different parts of this particular program. You're going to want to start off by having your browser opened on your Chromebook. And you can do that by clicking on the Chrome icon down here in the bottom left corner. And then once the browser opens, in the top left corner, you're going to look for the words BP Hawks bookmarks. And really, this is a drop down menu. So if you click on it, the menu will appear and you're going to find all of the websites that are saved that will come back here quite often. And Schoology is one of them. So Schoology is towards the bottom. You're going to click on it. And that's going to open up a window that you have to sign in with. Your sign in is going to be your last name, dot first name at bphawks.org. And I'm not going to use my account here. I'm going to actually create an, well, I'm not going to create an account. I'm going to use uh, Charlie's account. I don't think she'll mind, but that at least will show you how to see a student's account instead of mine. So it'll be Charlie's last name dot first name. And then I'm going to do the at symbol. So you have to hold the shift key down and hit strike the number two. It's BP Hawks dot or period. And then you type the letters O R G. You'll click next. You'll type your password, which is L I N C one, two, three period. That's the same password we've been using to log into the Chromebook. This will then open up Schoology and it will show you the special places that each of the teachers are keeping your assignments. Mrs. Kelvey's assignments are in the homeroom area right here. It says welcome to second grade. Now Charlie happens to have this particular, I call it a tile. It's a, um, it's a homeroom tile and it's a button. You can actually click on it and it will take you somewhere. My homeroom tile is here. But if you take the elevator down, the other teachers are going to be further down where you'll see art and health and music and library and phys ed. If I scroll down just a little bit more, you'll see phys ed. So each of those teachers have their assignments on their page. Mrs. Kelvey's assignments are on our homeroom page. So back up here to the top is where you would click to find my assignments for you. Each of these that are marked do not enter are places that have, don't have assignments in them. So you don't have to click on them because there's nothing there right now. Uh, you always come to courses. So if you click up here at the top where these turn orange, courses will just bring you back to your list of courses, which I'm a course, Mrs. Paz is a course, Mr. Bose and so on, all of the teachers that you have this year or have a course and they've created their assignments for you. So if you click under homeroom, it's going to open up my homeroom page. And it begins with the banner at the top, which is just a fancy picture that welcomes you. So there it is right there. And then below the banner, there are buttons. I have them in the shape of an arrow. But if you click on each of these buttons, it actually takes you to a special place where I've put the schedule because the first button said schedule and that's where it takes you. It shows you the schedule. So if you didn't remember your specials on a Monday, you could come to your schedule and you could look those specials up. What do, what special do I have on a Monday? I have library. You want to close this window. The top tab has an X you click on it and that closes the window. It brings you back to the Schoology, uh, homeroom page that we were just on, All right? Each of these arrows or buttons take you somewhere in a moment. The assignment is for you to uh, think of an expectation for rules or expectations that we would have during a virtual lesson. So that would be right here at this button. You would click and you would find our list of rules for how we behave during a virtual lesson strategies that we can use to stay focused and do our best. So as this opens, you'll see that this is a list of those strategies, right? 
This will be important in a moment when you go to do your assignment. You're going to have to pick one of these and you'll type it in. There's a place to type it in. And you can always come back here to view this. I'll show you that in a second. I'm going to get I'm going to close this page by clicking on the X. I'm going to come back to the Schoology banner and the buttons that are left are coming soon buttons. They're not they're not done. My my plan is to have a zoom button here where you will be able to click on this arrow and go straight to our live meetings. So you won't have to worry about um, getting an email and, and getting the link. It'll be all right here on this Schoology homeroom page. This Meet Mrs. K is just another place. If you want to check it out, you can. It, you've, you've already seen that information, more than likely. All right, so as you move down, taking the elevator over here to the right down, scrolling down, you're going to find where I put the assignments. And you're, you're going to see that each teacher does this very similarly. So Mrs. Paz, Mr. Shaw, and so on, are, they're going to have a banner. They might have some buttons. And then they're going to list the assignments. So the folder is what you want to look for, at least for Mrs. Kelvey's homeroom, because I put assignments in a folder. And if you open up that folder, you'll find what you need. This folder is marked week of September 1st through the 4th. That's this week. So that is the correct folder to click on. That will open the folder. And it will just show you more places within the week, which are the days of the week that you can click. So today you're viewing this video on a Wednesday. You're going to click on the Wednesday folder because we're looking for Wednesday's assignments. We won't click twice in the future. I have to fix this, but keep clicking by opening the Wednesday folder until you get to the assignments. And here they are. These are the assignments for Wednesday. And I have two questions to, uh, to accomplish here, two things to answer. And then there's the video that you're viewing right now. This is a link to the video. If you do these assignments as they appear, then as you finish one, it will take it away and you'll just have the next one to do. Um, the two assignments that I would like you to do, I want to show you, and then I'm going to give you time to go and explore your Schoology page and to do these assignments. Um, I'm asking a question on this assignment, so I'm going to click it, because in order to answer the question, you have to click. I'm going to read right here where it gives the directions. Please take a look around your Schoology homepage. Check out the links on the banner at the top of the page. So that was the page we I showed you with the fancy picture. And it says click on the online expectations button. That's my rules button. So you can click on that button. And it says what is one of our online expectations? Type it in the discussion. If you click in this box, it creates a text box and you can type on your Chromebook the answer that I'm looking for here. And I'm not going to do it because this is Charlie's uh, and, or Charlie's question and she's going to answer it here in a moment. Um, when I do put letters or when I type text, it will make this button appear blue. It darkens it and that's where you would post it. That's like a submit button. It sends what you did to Mrs. Kelvey and I can check it. Right? So this is one place that you're going to do something in a moment with. I'm going to take this away so that we don't have anything there for Charlie. And if I go back to the folder, the other part of this assignment was the practice test. And it's so simple. It's two questions, the really, really simple questions that you will be able to answer. But I just want you to get the feel for what it might be like to take um, a test or, or an assessment on Schoology. So you'll start this. There's two questions and then you'll submit it. And then Mrs. Kelvey will get the results. And that kind of brings you to the end of today's assignment, the two written things that I want you to do. The other part of the assignment, of course, is just to get used to how do I find Schoology and what are some special parts of it, like the buttons, the banner that I want you to take a look at, the, file, the folders, and even check out the other teachers' um, pages that were on that, um, that initial page, including Mrs. Kelvey's homeroom page. So that's, uh, that will wrap it up here for this video. And I'll see you later this afternoon after, if you have any questions, I can answer them at that time. 
All right, good luck and go ahead, get started now at this time. Thank you.